12 most active volcanoes. Number 12, the Eyjafjall Lair Kuto. The name for this Icelandic volcano literally translates to Island Mountain Glacier in English, and it's one of the smaller ice caps of Iceland. The ice cap blankets the caldera of the volcano with the summit at an elevation of 5,466 feet. It was back in 2010 when an eruption had caused massive disturbance to air travel all around Western and Northern Europe. Roughly 20 different countries were forced to shut down their airspace to commercial jet traffic, and more than 100,000 people were infected. <laughs> Number 11, the Ulawun Volcano. This happens to be one of the most active volcanoes in the Papua New Guinea region. The eruptions originate from the volcano's central crater, and there have been 22 eruptions documented there since the 1700s. In the last several years, the activity at Ulawun has been quite regular, with local residents consistently seeing many explosions that send up ash and lava into the nearby regions. Because of the volcano's extreme height, it's at risk of a structural collapse that would prove to be seriously catastrophic and cause an eruption that would cover up to 100 square kilometers of the surrounding area. Number 10, Mount Maripai. In English, Mount Maripai literally translates to mountain of fire which is a perfectly fit name for Indonesia's most active volcano. This volcano is known for producing the most amount of lava flow than any other volcano on the planet. Since 1548, this volcano has been regularly erupting and has been active for the last 10,000 years. Many experts hypothesize that this is the reason for the destruction of the Hindu kingdom of Mataram. It was back in 2010 when an eruption had killed 353 people and left around 320,000 citizens Number 9, the Sakurajima Volcano. The Sakurajima Volcano is classified as a composite volcano and is located in Japan where it used to be its own island. This changed when lava flows from the volcano's 1914 eruption connected it to the mainland. It's often referred to as the Vesuvius of the East by several experts because of the high levels of volcanic activity. Each year, there are roughly thousands of small explosions that come from the volcano's summit. If a major eruption were to occur, it would spell out deadly consequences for the 700,000 citizens of Kagoshima who live only miles away from the volcano. The city has even been equipped with special volcano shelters where people can go to avoid falling debris. Number 8, Mount Vesuvius. Perhaps the most famous volcano in all of history is Mount Vesuvius that can be found in Campania, Italy. Mount Vesuvius was the volcano that managed to bury the entire city of Pompeii along with Herculaneum and killing an estimated 16,000 people. This volcano's track record and active history have made it all too clear that it is one of the most dangerous volcanoes in the entire world. The last time this erupted was back in 1944 and usually has had an eruption cycle of 20 years. Over 3 million people are said to live near the crater, most notably the city of Naples that is just five miles east of the volcano. This volcanic region is the most densely populated area in all of the world. Number 7, the Ta'al Volcano. The Ta'al Volcano, nicknamed Volcano Island, is classified as a cinder cone volcano. It can be found on the island of Luzon in the Philippines, where it sits in the center of Lake Ta'al. It's only 31 miles away from the country's capital, Manila, that is home to a population of around 1.6 million people. Since 1572, this volcano has had a staggering 33 eruptions reported. Most of the eruptions were restricted to the Intra Caldera region, though there have been some that have completely destroyed the whole area. It's believed that there have been between 5,000 and 6,000 people who died from the volcano's eruptions. Number 6, Mount Niyiragongo. Mount Niyiragongo is considered as one of the most active volcanoes that can be found on the continent of Africa. It's famously known for its huge lava lakes, which are often seen in its crater. Niyiragongo poses a special threat to the neighboring communities as it's a steep-sided stratovolcano that carries a massive lake of lava. On January of 1977, the crater's wall cracked and the lava drained out within the hour. Back in 2002, there was a major explosion that caused 400,000 people to evacuate. The lava flow managed to destroy 4,500 buildings, leaving 120,000 people homeless and another 147 dead. 
Number five, the Galeras Volcano. The Galeras Volcano can be found in the southern Colombian region, close to the border where Colombia meets Ecuador. Amazingly, this volcano has remained active for at least the last one million years. The first recorded case of this volcano's eruption was documented back in the year 1580. There's a small city named Pasto that is found on the eastern slope and is the home to roughly 450,000 people, which does raise some concern. The volcano managed to go dormant from 1978 to 1988, but during a conference to discuss its potential dangers, it ironically erupted and killed six scientists and three tourists. For the last 16 years, it's erupted almost each year. Number 4. The Popocatepetal Volcano. Popocatepetal is a massive volcano whose summit is covered by a glacier and is located an estimated 35 miles from Mexico City. There are approximately 9 million people that are currently living within the volcano's blast radius, and it has managed to erupt more than 20 times since 1519. Its last major eruption was documented back in 2000, and it did erupt to a smaller degree earlier this year, back on April 3rd. <laughs> Number three, the Yellowstone Supervolcano. Yellowstone National Park is recognized for its immense beauty, but below the surface of the park lies a supervolcano that has the capacity to eviscerate the entire Western United States and change the course of human history. The eruption of a supervolcano is a phenomenon that has never been viewed by mankind and should not be wished to be viewed. Researchers believe that if the Yellowstone Supervolcano were to erupt, it would instantly kill around 87,000 people, along with the ash and gas affecting the world's food supply in unknown ways. Number 2. The Kilauea Volcano This Hawaiian volcano has been active for the last 33 years, and it's been stated by the U.S. Geological Survey that this is one of the most active volcanoes to currently exist on Earth. The volcano has recently gotten a lot of attention when Mick Culver was flying over the volcano managed to capture this image of a smiley face in a lava lake crater. The Hawaiian Volcano Observatory states that the smiley face was formed by lava upwelling and downwelling that causes the lava to spatter, and as a result, the surface pulls apart to show the lava underneath. Number 1. The Mauna Loa Volcano When it comes to the surface area and volume, Mauna Loa is considered to be the largest volcano in the whole world. It also happens to be one of the five major volcanoes located in the Pacific Ocean that contributes to the geographical makeup of the island of Hawaii. This active volcano has been constantly erupting for the better half of 700,000 years, with its last major eruption happening back in 1984. The only threat this volcano poses is the flow of lava, However, its lava moves at such a slow pace that the danger level is very minimal. 